Hey everybody, Rick Needham Handicapping, Thoroughbred Racing from my hometown track, Penn National Race Course, Grandfield, Pennsylvania on Friday evening, July the 22nd, and this is my dayatthetrack.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 5 tonight, folks, 7.38 p.m. Eastern Post Time. It's a five and a half furlong sprint on the dirt track, three year olds and up race for an optional claiming tag of $34,000. Contenders number 3, the Elevator. Number eight, Norjack. Number four, Rexdale Warrior. And number seven, Breezy Boy. Number three, the Elevator, has won 11 times in his career to date, sprinting at or about tonight's distance of five and a half furlongs on the dirt. Takes a four level track master class drop. Has hit the board in power run fashion in four of his last five adventures, including back to back to back power run wins in his third through his fifth races back. Jockey. Ricardo Feliciano and trainer Jimmy Ness send them post run this evening. They whacked the toe board with an impressive 70% of more than 50 entry saddles as a team to date, winning at an equally impressive 34% clip. Number 8, Norjack, a 4 1 shot, has hit the board in four of his last five. Two of those board hit efforts also qualifying as power runs. Race 5 summary number 3, the Elevator, tops my contenders list, which also includes number 8, Norjack, number 4, Rexdale Warrior, and number 7, Breezy Boy, 3847, the fifth from Penn National. Bonus long shots, Finger Lakes, race 4, the 6 to 1 shot, number 5, Linear Motion. Nice overall speed for the 6 for a long sprint, is hit the board in power run fashion in two of his last three starts. Mountaineer Park, race 7, entry number 2, Truly Broadway, an 8-1 to one shot, drops in class by 6 units as the overall speed leader in his claiming field, sprinting at 6 furlongs on the dirt. So, from Penn National, on a Friday night, Rick Needham for dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over.